Hey girl, hey. So today I'm here to do a video all about what is in my bag for the summer. And this bag, let me just talk about before I talk about what's inside of it. Um, this is a bag from Brandy Melville. I know everyone is going like Brandy Melville crazy right now, but um, yeah, I got it when I was in New York and I absolutely adore it. I saw it. We were just kind of like browsing around. I didn't think I was gonna get anything and I saw this hanging up on the wall and I just about died because I love floral bags, floral anything basically, um, but especially bags and backpacks in particular, which this is a backpack, and it didn't have like one of those like flaps that looks like it's difficult to work with and stuff. It's just a plain zipped up backpack. So I saw it and I thought it was adorable and I had to get it. I, I got it in April. It's probably still available. Ivory kind of creamy color with these floral prints all over it and it's a good material. It's sturdy. It hasn't broken on me yet and I've been using it during the summer and stuff like that and I just absolutely love it. It's a perfect summer bag because you just sling up your shoulder. It's lightweight. Um, it's not like waterproof or anything. I wouldn't bring this to the beach, but um, I adore it all the same. So I'm just going to be talking about what's inside of it first. I'm going to go through, there's a little pouch and then a big pouch. There's no real like pockets inside or anything. It's pretty simple, um, but I'm going to go through what's in the little pouch. And just FYI, I don't know why I did this. FYI, I'm used to being a camp where you have to silence children all day. But FYI, <laughs> um, this stuff is kind of like random and I, like I'm an overpacker at everything. So I definitely have more than I need in here, but this is just what I carry on with me in the summer. So. First, I have a pack of gum, extra gum. This is peppermint, and I love any blue gum. Something about me is like, I hate green gum. Spearmint, ugh, bleh. But I love blue gum, so that's what I always eat. Eat, chew. I just have a set of earbuds, headphones, whatever. Um, I don't actually use these very often, which you'd think I would, um, but they're just for my phone because it's like also an iPod because it's an iPhone. So I like to listen to music sometimes. I like the ones with the squishy end like that because they fit in my ears better and they don't like fall out that easily and they feel better. Like the ones that are like little plastic buds, um, they always like hurt my ears for some reason. So I really like these. Um, yay for earbuds that don't cause you pain. Then I have a lip balm. This is one of my favorites and this is the EOS Sweet Mint Lip Balm. And it's like the little egg one. Um, that everyone loves and something happened to it to deform it a little. I don't really know how to explain this um, But I think the cap got like jammed on it several times and it has like this like lip Thing several times in it, but it still works Right why waste it? I have a little mirror that says Paris on it and this is gonna get annoying trying to focus this every time but it has an Eiffel Tower and it says Paris and it's like reflective on the front too, so you can see my camera already. And then like it's reflective on the back and it's kind of like a fisheye. Has a magnified mirror and a regular, or wait. Yeah, this is definitely the regular side. And this is the magnified side, I think. It's hard to tell when you're looking through a camera viewfinder. On the go, easy. Um, got it at a really cheap tourist place in Paris. I actually have a USB stick. I really don't, I don't even know why. I think it was because like, I kept it in the small pocket of my school bag, and then I just like transferred a bunch of stuff into here. Um, so yeah, and the really cool thing about this, I don't know if I've ever showed this on my channel. I know I Instagrammed it, and people were like, what the heck? But this is in the shape of a Nike shoe. And like, looking at it, it just looks like a really cheap plastic toy shoe. But you open it up, and bam! It has a USB end. Like, how cool is that? I, I was pretty flabbergasted when I saw it. But, um, it's actually a long story, but not really. But, like, my, um, teacher for sociology class, we did this thing. No, I'm pretty sure this was for quotes. It was, I think it was Thursdays. Um, we had, ugh, there was a word for it, but I don't remember what it was. But it was just, like, a time at the beginning of class where we'd write down a quote or something, like, thought-provoking that was interesting or something. And we'd hand it in to him, and he'd pick a winner of the one he liked the best or that, you know, was the most interesting. And then he had like this really random box of goodies for you to win things out of and you could pick what you wanted. And his brother works like up pretty high up in Nike. Um, if you guys don't know, Nike was founded in Portland. So there's a lot of Nike around here. So um, he got this like random shoe USB, which I didn't even know was made, but I love it. So now I have it and it happily blooms in my summer bag. Not that exciting. I have an inhaler in here because I have asthma. Um, self-explanatory I feel. So now I'm going to dive into the big pouch and I have a lot of random random stuff in here that's like it looks like I'm going on a week-long trip or something. My Amazon Kindle, whoops, um, I'd love to read. I read like all the time. I'm working on a book right now 
called Legend, which it's kind of weird. I'm not gonna lie. But anyway, so um, yeah, I take this everywhere because if I'm like waiting for something or doing something or not doing something, then I read. I also have a magazine in here. This is Teen Vogue. Um, I only read Seventeen and Teen Vogue, or like those are the ones that I'm subscribed to. Um, so yeah, this is new. I haven't even had a chance to look through this because I've been so busy. Um, so I threw it in my bag just to like encourage myself to read it one of these days. But it's the one with Andrew Garfield and Emma Stone on the cover, which I really, really, really want to see the Spider-Man movie. I want to see it, but like we're waiting for my friend to come back because she wanted to see it with us, but it's just like killing me because I want to see it now. Um, and I think Andrew Garfield's actually pretty cute, so I'm pretty excited to read this. There's probably like some intense article about their movie shooting. Oh, that's a weird hat outfit. Dog. Not dog. Just kidding. I don't know. Okay. This is going away now. My camera. Um, who needs a case when you could use a mitten glove? Not a mitten. Um, to hold your camera in. Ta-da! That's basically what I do is, um, I don't have a case for it, so I keep it in a glove. And it actually works surprisingly well. Um, so yeah, this is my camera. I used to film on this, actually. It was like my second camera, but I used it pretty early when on in my YouTube. But this is the Samsung TL220, and it is a picture-taking camera, but I actually film with it. It has decent quality. Um, it's kind of quiet, though, so that's why I stopped using it and it didn't focus very well. But um, it's really good for pictures, so I keep it with me. I don't take that many pictures, to be honest, um, but I'm, I bring it with me to kind of, like, encourage myself to, but it hasn't worked very well so far. I have sunglasses. This is, like, a really bulky case. It's, like, metallic gold. Um, it's one of those hard cases that flips open like this. And these sunglasses, I'm pretty sure, are from Nordstrom. Um, I got them when I was in California looking at colleges. And I was, like, walking with my mom. I was like, Mom, I don't have any sunglasses. She's like, Christy, let's go buy some. So we did. They were, like, really big for my face. But, yeah. I kind of like them. I think they suit me. Maybe. And I just have my keys on this little thing from Glitzy Glam. Ellen Blair Army represent. Um, I have my car keys, my house key. A really loud, random Roxy keychain. Starbucks card and chapstick holder. Nail polish in here. I'm not even wearing this. Um, I think I threw it in here when I was wearing it to touch it up, but I never used it, so I should probably put it back. But this is Aquadelic by China Glaze. It's a really pretty um, turquoise blue. You just have a pen. You never know when you're gonna need a pen, right? And this is the Paper Mate. Does it matter? No. Next is my wallet. Um, this is pretty important. Like, if I had one thing, it'd probably be my wallet or my inhaler. Hmm, I don't know. But this is really, really old, really worn out, um, but I love it so much. But I actually bought a new wallet. Um, it was a birthday present. My birthday was May 29th. It's like July like 19th or something right now. I don't even know what it is. Um, but me and my mom bought it online and then it came and it wasn't the right color and then it was like back ordered. So we finally ordered one and it's back ordered again. So it should be here like sometime in August, I guess. But um, but for now I have my lovely Billabong one. I love the colors on it, but it definitely needs some help so um i've had this for literally probably since like sixth or seventh grade not even lying cards driver's license cash money whatever and i have way too many coins in here it's like bulging i have a sunscreen stick it looks very much like a deodorant but i want to stress to you that it is not deodorant um it is a sunscreen stick and it's spf 30 neutrogena oil free sunscreen stick and i just keep it with me because i have a lot of pale girl problems that need sunscreen Rollerball of aquiline pink sugar, which has turned quite yellow at its aging state, but I still love it. Little mini hairbrush. Um, it's like one of those jelly grip ones that I love. And my hair gets tangly, sort of. Kind of. I don't really know. I just keep it with me. Two things that are in here is, first of all, some NYX green tea blotting papers. I got these at iMats because I was looking kind of shiny. And I use them sometimes in the summer. I kind of forget about them, like, a lot, but... In case I don't, they're in here. And last but not least, I have a moisturizer. I actually just got this, but um, it's like this green apple SPF 15 moisturizer, and I just keep it in my bag now. I just threw it in there because I want to have some sort of moisturizer because my skin's really dry um, from camp and stuff. And I haven't actually used this, so I should probably test it out before I use it in case it like makes me break out in like hives or something. I don't know, but I just have it in there just in case. It's everything inside my bag. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. Um, comment down below some of your like staples to keep in your bag during the summer. I know I keep way too much stuff, and I'm probably gonna like kill my back one of these days. Um, but I love you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. And comment down below what you would um, like that to be, and I'll try and make it happen. So, have a great day! Okay, we're good. Bye, guys!